To add a transaction in Brevity, just click the plus sign next to the corresponding tab on the left navigation panel. First, you'll indicate whether this is a listing transaction or a buyer pending transaction. I'll begin with the listing. First, you're going to add a marketing title, something descriptive yet brief, like beautiful waterfront home. This title can be changed at a later time, but do note that it will be referenced when you market using Brevity. Next, you're going to assign a property type. Generally, this will be residential, but you can select from our default options or add your own. Enter the address, include the expiration date, and of course, the postal code. At this point, you'll assign the primary listing agent. The agent you select is the person that is representing the transaction. Email updates that are sent out to your clients will be sent from this agent's email address and will include their photo and contact information. Any leads that come in from this listing's property page will also be sent to this agent directly via email. After you have completed the first step of the form, select Continue. If you wish to publish the listing now, you must complete the second step of the form. Otherwise, you can skip ahead. To edit details you provided during step one, select Back. To complete the second step, enter the price, MLS number, number of beds and baths, and square footage then provide a description of the listing. After you've completed the second step of the form, select Continue. On to the third and final step. If you already know the action and advertising plans you'd like to apply, now's a great time to add them. Otherwise, leave the selection blank. Upload the primary photo for your listing. To edit details provided during step two, select Back. If your listing's information has been entered, select Finish. You'll now see your listing added among your transactions in the Transaction tab. At this point, you can choose to specify more transaction details, or you can come back and add to them at a later time. Select Save Details to preserve any changes. Now let's review how to add a buyer pending transaction. Click the plus sign right next to the Transaction tab on the left navigation panel. This time, select Buyer Pending Transaction. Enter the property type address, specify an expiration date, and a postal code for this transaction. Then, once again, specify the primary agent. If you already know the action plan you'd like to apply, now's a great time to add one. Otherwise, leave the selection blank. Then, select Finish. You'll now see your buyer pending transaction added among your transactions in the Transaction tab. At this point, you can choose to specify more transaction details, or you can come back and add to them at a later time. Select Save Details to preserve any changes.